Ready for a future bunk bed playroom update? Remember, this is what we started with. When we left off last time, we were installing the beadboard. Now that the beadboard is up, I went ahead and installed all of the trim pieces, which includes the header, a corner piece, and some shoe molding. Then I went ahead and primed the entire room. Bye bye bright teal and hello skipping stones. This is the perfect vintage blue that I wanted for the space. I shared my best tips for getting the most professional paint lines. And if you missed it, you can head on over to the blog or catch up in our stories highlights. After the main room was painted, we went ahead and jumped over to the sensory closet and got that all built up for him. That included a DIY rock wall and also assembling this really cool climbing gym. Up next, we'll be wallpapering the main room. Here's a sneak peek of what it's gonna look like. Follow along as we wrap up this room renovation.